versus an NC State team that has lost three of its last four games. But Courtney Banghart, the coach for North Carolina, said it doesn't matter. Over 50% of their scoring and rebounding, and you can see for Carolina, they've had some injuries to hit them. But Kayla McPherson, you mentioned her, one of the more exciting players in the ACC. Deja Kelly, the leading scorer on this team. There's McPherson. That we're used to seeing her have on that shot, still being hampered by that injury. And at times you can see her favor that shot clock dying for Kelly. Puts it up and in. Those are the ones you need to see go through the bottom of the net to build some confidence. They're 0 for 5 so far in this game. Make it 1 for 6 as Rivers. Yeah, it has. And you know, I appreciate his honesty and really just communicating, you know, how tough it has been as Deja Kelly gets to a game full of, full of great leaders, everyone understanding their role, everyone being consistent in terms of how they play and, and coming to play. And this has just been a different year as Jakia Brown Turner knocks down a three. And not, they lose four starters that you mentioned, NC State, but four impactful people, not just as scorers, but as leaders. Inside, Anya Poole gets her first basket, did not play. Took him to eight NCAA tournaments. Hobby, who has been backing up Elisa Kunane her entire career until this year. Uh, Deja Kelly, all the fans in red wanted a foul call. Uh, Step through. What a move. But you know what, when, when you get this, this opportunity to, to play through adversity, it really prepares you for postseason. James. And right now Duke is down 43-24 at Virginia Tech. When started knocking down a three-point shot, has gotten to the rim a couple of times as well. James! NC State had won three in a row in the series. Still Carolina had a big fourth quarter to win last month. By James! Coach Moore wanted to shut down North Carolina's transition game, which can be so dangerous. Done a good job of it lately. Paris finally gets the first three of the game. Uh, Todd Williams somehow was able to get that shot away. She works that pivot until she finds an outlet. Now we hear people in the building yelling for a travel call, but she's keeping that foot down. Mimi Collins, the well traveled. And again, attention to detail in that scout. That is really good defense. And Madison Hayes going the other way. McPherson kicking it over. Adams, there's their second three of the evening. I could have thought about it. Bobby, terrific pass and a better move to get the shot off. Working on her master's degree, loving college experience. Great student athlete. Oh, a little back off of Deja Kelly. That's all she needed. Yep, and that's a breakdown. Opportunity for Carolina to take the lead. Harris, the freshman, all the way to the cup. And what this does is it allows Courtney Banghart to build her depth. Paulina Paris getting more minutes than maybe she would have before. Tayani Key as well. Donna Johnson gets to becoming more of a multi-dimensional threat. McPherson in the open court on any fast break is terrifying. But two of six from the floor coming off a career high 22 against BC. Zelaya left open, and this time, I think this is a big defensive stand right here for, for NC State. This is a fifth turnover for State. McPherson. And before that Virginia game, Bullock had really been struggling with her shot. Kelly elevates so quickly. Uh, Williams knocked away by Rivers. Kelly recovered. Tell you what, Alexandra Zelaya is not afraid to... A little bit more energy offensively in this second half. Alexandra Zelaya knocking the corner. NC State looking for its first field goal of the quarter. They have one point. Boyd again. Much needed three. 
Sunday afternoon, Liz Kittler with a double-double. Georgia Amor, Amor, pardon me, also with 20 points. Baldwin, terrific river speed. Todd Williams forcing it. And the outside shot nailed by Adams. Shot clock. No shot because Kelly lost it. Now River's turn on the break. 6-4, Sanaya. Playing for that, playing for seeding in the NCAA tournament as well. Getting into that top four. Amy Collins starts things off well in the fourth quarter. Her and really for NC State to be successful, Diamond Johnson has to be a double-figure scorer. Yeah. Playing on that bum ankle. Kelly, oh my, that back going in. Got away from Paris. James. Little off bounds, but Mimi Collins saves the ball. Paris answers. It's over dribbling. It's trying to make something out of nothing instead of letting the offense work. Nice. Tough night for Johnson. Paris has decided to attack the basket and was fouled. And she went yeah, for it. She sure did, and, and she did a really good job right there of splitting the D. People as rookies of the week. NC State has missed 10 of its last 11 shots. That one went in for Boyd. A good screen by Jakia Brown Turner gives Jada Boyd just enough time. Power dribble, finish in the other side. Another hustle play. And Boyd waited patiently and converted. Kelly found a little bit of space, and that little quiet would have become a very. Give me the ball, I'll get to my spots and knock down the shot. Collins, nailed it! Harris, the, the rookie does it again! Cool, blocked by Collins! Follow good! Collins, with the ball! Down turn for three. Oh, and then Westmore wants the timeout to advance. Here we go. A two to tie, a three to take the lead. Hammer. James ties it. Of the Wolfpack bench. Here's McPherson, the fastest player on the court. It's taken away by James. Her miss, Tania Rivers. To stop the breakaway layup. Harris inbounds. Too tall for Key. On both sides of the ball. Yes. James forcing it up and it went in somehow. Brown Turner. They got a hurry. They threw it away. So they lose the extra ball here. And it turns into two points for James. Rivers charges with just over two seconds. And if you're Carolina, you want to keep putting pressure on this defense. Keep attacking the rim. You're getting opportunities at the foul line. Well, Kelly left it well short. If they get it in, you can expect a foul. But there's the touchdown pass, and James has dropped it off. McPherson, two straight air balls. Kelly with the grab with the leg.
And the Rams, since then, they have outscored North Carolina by 21 points. And they didn't. Back was against the wall. They came to play. They stepped up to the challenge. Harris finally. Can you imagine what the tournament's going to be like? It's going to be so much fun. <laughs> Terrific. Down the stretch and in overtime. And then she got the rebound. There's going to be some happy people on Hillsborough Street tonight. What? A fourth quarter, well, the last four minutes of the fourth quarter and overtime for the pack.